Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Okay, today I thought I would go over 10 of my favorite things. I feel like Oprah, but nobody's getting a free car. <laughs> But I thought since the holidays are right around the corner, I thought I would go over some of my favorite things. They price in some very inexpensive, a couple dollars, to some on the higher price range. So if you're interested in what 10 of my favorite things are, then please keep on watching. Okay, I'm going to start off with this sweatshirt. It says running on coffee and dry shampoo. Ever since COVID, well, even before COVID, I was really into loungewear. But this lounge, this sweatshirt is so soft and it's so comfortable and it's by PJ Salvage. I got this at Nordstrom Rack, but any of the PJ Salvage sweatshirts are so comfortable to wear and they're so amazingly soft. And for COVID, I think it's the best thing to get and everyone's lounging at home. I can maybe get by with this being a sweatshirt if I had to leave the house to go drop off my daughter to dance or bring her, pick her back up. But I love this. It's one of my favorite things. I recently got this. So this is my first pick. My second pick is by a brand called Viori, V-U-O-R-I. They're lounge pants. They look like sweatpants and these are the softest sweatpants you'll ever feel. Now these are available at Nordstrom's. They're so comfortable. They fit me perfectly in height. Um, they're also available on the Viore website. And if you're a first time customer there, you can get 20% off your order. And I did do that. Um, but this one is from Nordstrom's. Super comfortable for loungewear, sweatpants. Oh, no zipper, the best. Isn't that the best for COVID? So Viore sweatpants are one of my favorite things as well. Let's keep moving along. So like I said, I do love coffee and dry shampoo. Okay, so as for coffee, I have something that's a little bit expensive. It's my coffee machine. I didn't bring it up here, but I will have a picture of it right here for you. It is by the brand Magnifica XS. And this coffee machine, it's an espresso maker and a coffee maker. And I know it's a little bit on the pricey side. I got this at Costco. I remember my husband first brought me a coffee machine for my birthday. I was so pissed. Well, who gets a coffee machine for their birthday? Yes, I love coffee, but nobody wants a coffee machine, right? <laughs> well, I was proved wrong. I love these more pricey coffee machines because I buy the espresso beans from Costco. They're like $9.99 a bag. And I put them into the machine and it makes the best cup of coffee. If you're one of those types that goes out to coffee shops and buys coffee all the time, this will be worth your return on investment because I don't go to coffee shops anymore. I take my own coffee with me everywhere I go, especially in the mornings. I make my own coffee and a cup of coffee is just a few cents because the big bag of espresso beans is only $10. So think about that and maybe you might want to invest in your coffee machine. The one I have, um, if I can still find it, I will link that below or I will find one that's similar to this one. And speaking on coffee on the go, the best coffee mug ever. It's by Zojirushi. Don't mind this sticker. This is my sticker. This is a Japanese brand. It opens and closes like this and it pops open like this and it's got this lip. Once you close it, you can lock it and unlock it so that it doesn't fall apart. I put this in my handbag and it doesn't leak anywhere. This thing will keep my coffee hot. I mean like hot for a good six hours before it starts warming down. So this coffee, I give this coffee mug to teachers as Christmas or birthday gifts or end of year gifts every year. It's the best travel mug ever, especially if you like hot coffee. So I love this and I've been loving this for years and anyone I recommend it to, they love it and they give it as gifts too. So, Zojirushi coffee mug, travel mug. And speaking of coffee, when I'm at home and I'm working on my computer, like editing videos or doing something like that, I like to have my coffee warmer. When I'm drinking coffee from a mug, I like to have this right by my desk and it warms my coffee and keeps it warm in case I don't drink it gulp, 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 gulp right away. 
this little thing i got it off of amazon i will have this link down below by the way i don't make any money with affiliate links because i'm not that big of a channel i'm just trying to share with you my favorite things okay <laughs> But this coffee warmer is so great. I have one by my bedside table and I also have one by my, um, on my desk in my office because I like to drink tea at night while I'm reading and so I put my cup of tea on here, my sleepy time tea to go to bed. Oh, that could have been one of my favorite things too. But alas, so I love this coffee warmer and this I got this off Amazon and it's a great gift for anybody who likes to drink something hot. Okay, now keeping on the drinking theme, I'm not going into alcohol. I'm going to talk about this Yeti tumbler. Now I've got stickers all over it like I'm a high school kid. You can't see this, but it's a sloth meditating because I do like to meditate. And my spirit animal is a sloth. I move really slow. <laughs> but this Yeti cup, I like to drink um, Oh, Soda Stream could have been my other favorite. I love carbonated water, but I love bubbly water. And so the Soda Stream, I'm gonna link that even though I don't have it here. I love to drink bubbly water, but I put ice in here and I'll put bubble water in here. And if I put that in the evening, the next morning, there's still ice in here. It still keeps it cold. This tumbler is amazing. I think it, when I got it, I've had this for years. I don't remember how much it was now, but it has been so worth the price. You don't use plastic, so that's a good thing. You put ice water in here and it stays icy cold for 12 hours at least, and the ice is still in there? Come on, you can't beat that. Okay, another of my favorite things is candles. I love candles. And so I have this, mine is all trashed. You can see that there. I have this USB lighter. You plug it in right there to the USB port and it charges and then, can you see that? Oh, no, mine is dead. Well, there's like a current that goes through there to light your candle. I just used this this morning. I can't believe this is dead now. Well, there's a little electric current that goes in there and this bends. So you can put it into a deep candle, whatever you want. Love this. I got this off of Amazon years ago and it still works really, really well. So I highly recommend this as a lighter for your candles and you just charge it so you don't even need to put batteries in there or go get more um, clickers when the gas runs out. So this is a favorite. Now, some of you may or may not know is I'm a scrapbooker, I like to do memory keeping, I'm a planner girl. So with that in mind, I wanted to show you my favorite planner and it is called a Hobonichi Techo and I got the one for 2021. It's got the smoothest paper in here and it's made out of Tomoe River paper. This opens so it lays flat and this and the paper is so thin and it is a pleasure, a pleasure to write on. So this has items so that you can go by monthly. Let me show you. So it has the monthly view. It has a weekly view like this. So days of the weekend columns. And then it has a daily view where you can document daily. Now I use this as my planner for every day. I have one for um, just my YouTube and then I have one for my family. I love writing in these. I do have a leather case to go around this, but I really wanted to mention the Hobonichi Techo as a great planner. If you're into um, analog planning or journaling, this is great. I've been using this for going on, I wanna say six or seven years, and I go back to the same planner every year and just get a new one for the new year. So Hobonichi Techo. As for pens, because I do a lot of memory keeping, I do a lot of journaling and stuff, my favorite pen is this Energel Klena. This is what it looks like. It is a gel pen, and let's see, I forgot to bring paper here. Oh, but I have this BK Beauty here. It writes like a dream, and it's so smooth, and I like the 0 0.5 and look at the tip. Can you see how fine that tip is? It's fine, but not so fine that it's scratchy. It does have, it has no scratchy, you know, when you're writing, it's so smooth and it's a pleasure to use. So this is the one that was a couple bucks of my favorite things. And they're 
are different color tops that come with this, but I always get the pink and I get several of these when I order these and I'll have that linked down below. Okay, let's see, I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine oh i already did nine things okay so my last one anyone can anyone guess it's my dyson air wrap i freaking love this thing so it has different attachments you know i ha i did buy the longer hair attachment the 1.6 inch one to put on this but i put the regular attachment to dry my hair and then i use this to curl and i i'll have that linked that video linked right here but this makes drying my hair and styling it, it takes less than 10 minutes. And my hair is almost down to my waist. So if you can imagine that, this thing, I wish I'd gotten it when it first came out and I'm so, well, no, I wouldn't be pissed. I should have gotten it when it first came out. How's that? Then I would have looked more put together because it takes less than 10 minutes to dry and style my hair. Now usually it takes 20 minutes to dry my hair and that's not even fully dried. That's not even style. That's just drying it because I have so much hair. But I got this for myself for my birthday at Ulta using a 20% off coupon using points and gift cards and this has been probably my favorite purchase of 2020. Can I say that? Maybe. But I am loving, loving this. Okay, so those are some of my favorite things. These are a few of my favorite things. Okay, I just wanted to show you what my favorite things are and pretend I'm like Oprah, but nobody gets anything free. Actually, ta-da! I have a giveaway for one lucky winner. I appreciate all of your guys' support as I've gone through this YouTube journey. I know that there are a lot of you that have been supporting me since the beginning and some of you have just started joining me on this um, journey of becoming a YouTuber. I wanted to say thank you so much for all of your support during this time. And so I have some of my favorite beauty items that I want to give away. So for my giveaway, I will have the Tower 28 lip glosses, the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Instant Eye Palette, the Charlotte Tilbury Film Star Bronze and Glow, the Mini, and then the Rare Beauty Concealer and Foundation Brush. To enter this giveaway, let me know down in the comments below what one of your favorite things is. Leave your Instagram handle or your email so I can contact you. I want you to go over to my Instagram and I will have that link down below as well. Go there, follow me, and on the picture of this, the items that I have on the giveaway, say that you, you're you there from this video so I know that you're entered. And follow me there as well. I'm gonna leave it open till the 21st. That way I can get it out and, and announce, a, announce a winner and get this posted out, maybe get it in time for Christmas. So make sure you enter the giveaway down below. Be sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know every time I upload a new video, and I'll see you next time.